the best clap as you can. Shout to Jesus. Hallelujah. I can feel somebody make some noise. Make some noise to the King of Kings, the Lord of Lords. Make some noise, make some noise. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. We take our seat in the mighty name of Jesus. Wow. I don't have any interpreter. Okay. Hallelujah. I thank God to stand before you. I know it's not easy to stand in this place. And especially it's not given to anybody to stand here. Amen. And I thank the father of the house, Pastor Bruno, for giving me the opportunity to to share what I have with you, which is the mind of God for his people for today's service. Amen. Uh, it's, I always said, when there's kids in the house playing alone, they make noise, amen? But the moment the father comes, they all discipline themselves without anybody telling them anything. And you can see them, they just signal each other like in sign, like do this, do that, but they cannot say because the father's there, amen? Yeah, they begin to speak in code because they are afraid of the father. But if the father then pick one among them and he say, you can do this, then you see that child who, are, who will stand with confidence and will begin to do things with a, a, a different energy because the father allowed him or her to do it you will not be afraid like the rest and that confidence is what I have this morning because the father has allowed me to speak to you amen, amen. and this morning I want to share a topic which has been preached for many preachers and there's nothing new I can bring here in fact the whole Bible has been preached already and the topic in which I want to speak about today is one of the common topics even if a child can tell you the story and it's one of the topics if you see an event or a seminar no, so money on a seminar, but a fish. Also, if you see it on the seminar, they pull it on the leaflet. Straight away, you know already what the preacher will talk about. You, you, you may not even want to go to that event because the topic alone says everything. Because the topic says everything. And the story is very easy to know. But this morning, I believe the Lord have a different revelation about this topic. And I believe deep down in my spirit, the revelation that will come in this place, you may never heard it before. Through the same story that you be listening over and over. The theme of my topic is who touched me um, si ya message leza, nana by saying who touched me already know he's talking about the woman with the nana issue lo, of blood but my subtitle in, into this is the revelation beyond shame Mais, rev, um, si, si leza, li, revelation après sony no. Revelation likolo ya soni beyond shame. Revelation likolo ya soni. Quickly, we're gonna read our Bible in Don't the book Bible of Abiso. Mark chapter five. Na Mark chapter five, from verse twenty-five. A partir de verse twenty-five. Whosoever found can read for us. Oh, ya komi ne sika ya ngopi soka goi kotangi la biso. 
Mark chapter 5 from verse 25 the Bible said and there was a woman there who had a, who has been a subject of bleeding for 12 years and she had suffered a great deal under the care of many doctors and had spent all she had yet instead of getting better she grew worse when she heard about Jesus came up and she came behind the crowd and, and touched the cloth of his garment because she thought if just I may touch the hem of his garment immediately if, if I might touch the hem of his garment I will be healed immediately verse 29 immediately her bleeding stopped and she felt in her body that she was fed from this suffering and at once Jesus realized that the power has gone out of him he turned around and in in the crowd and asked who touched my clothes you see the people crowding against you his disciple answered and yet you ask who touched me but Jesus kept looking around to see who has gone who has done it then the woman knowing that the only woman knowing that had happened to her and came up trembling before Jesus and told him the whole truth and he said to her doctor your faith has healed you go in peace amen amen we're gonna look the same story in the book of Luke chapter 8 from verse 40 because these are the disciples of Jesus who walk with Jesus and look if you look if you see the book of Luke and Mark they both speak the same story they both tell the same story but in different angles it's like something happened here if they ask mama jolie so she will tell her own story if they ask mama mifi she will also tell her some uh, own story so let's look what brother luke said from verse 40 luke chapter 8 luke chapter 8 a partir de verse 40 and now jesus returned and a crowd welcomed him for they were all expecting him then a man named Jairus, the ruler of the synagogue, came and felt at Jesus' feet, pleading with him to come to his house because his only daughter, girl who about 12 years old was dying. And Jesus was on his way and the crowd almost crouched him. And a woman was there who had been a subject to a bleeding for 12 years. And she had spent all that she had on on doctors and but no one could heal her she came up behind him and touched the edge of his garment immediately her bleeding stopped and Jesus said who touched me when they all denied it and Peter said master there are people around you how can you said who touched me but Jesus said someone has touched me I know because I felt the power left me. Then the woman, seeing what she she could see, then the woman see seeing what she have done, and came up trembling, fell at Jesus' feet in the presence of all the people, and she told him why she have touched him, and she explained the situation and how it stopped immediately then jesus said unto her daughter your faith has healed you go in peace amen amen hallelujah amen and i know this story we all know it but if you read the bible carefully the bible said that jesus came into the town and there was 
so many people crowded the bible said in the book of Luke that they were all expecting him some were expecting for a miracle some wanted him to touch them some wanted him to prophesy some wanted him to teach them the bible said they were all expected him and the Bible says that there was a man who was a ruler of the synagogue. His name was Jairus. And this Jairus was a ruler of the synagogue. And she had a child of 12 years old. And she was dying. The Bible said that this man among all the people who were expecting Jesus she also, I mean he also came and told Jesus the Bible said that this man came at the feet of Jesus he pleaded for mercy he said come to my house my child is dying and the Bible said that and the Jesus began to make his way to Jairus and he began to go to the house of Jairus. But along his way, there was a woman. The Bible says a woman with an uh, with issue of blood. Now, notice that the Bible says this woman's uh, issue was only the issue of blood. And the Bible said that this has been gone for 12 years. This is not 12 days. This is not 12 hours. But it's 12 years. Amen. And you know yourself, mother, if you be pleading for 12 years. You cannot be clean you probably be smelling if you bleed for 12 years non-stop uh, for 12 days non-stop you begin to worry you will not understand you'll be like what has happened to me as a result of it you, you want to seek for help it's exactly what this woman did and the bible said that she spent everything that she had in physician. By doing so, the Bible said that she suffered many things at the hand, at the hand of physician. Her issue was the issue of God. But by looking for help, but she began to suffer instead of this doctor to help her. They begin to make her even suffer more. The Bible said, if you read again, the Bible says she suffered many things at the hand of physicians. Which means her situation could have lasted only for a year. Her situation could only go for six months. But by desperate of seeking for help, she were falling into the hand of wrong people who were telling her for you to be healed you must drink tea in the morning and this tea so for me that tea, tea you can oh, only buy it at my hospital, my clinic. Oh, and one tea bag costs one thousand euro. Tea, ko, ko, kute, mil, eh, for her being desperate to be healed, na, kati, ya, po, sa, na, ye, she gave the money. A, pe, si, mo, na, and there was no result. Kasi, eh, and she moved to another doctor. A, like, pa, mung, and like, for you to be healed, ba, ke, po, yo, so, lo, you ke, must bat with this soap. E, fo, so, kula, na, savan, oh, and she buy it. A, la, sombi, savan, and po. there was no healing. And she went to another one. And the Bible says, instead of her getting a help, the situation grew worse. There's so many times in our life we face things that we cannot deal with ourselves. And we trust people that they might help us. Instead of, instead of them helping us, but they begin to gossip, gossiping about your 
your, your case. You are thinking that this is my best friend. This is my, 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 my best mother. Uh, if I go to speak to this father, he will tell me a good advice. But instead of him helping you, but the moment you turn your back, they begin to talk about you. Instead of your case being helped, it's getting worse. And the Bible said, instead of the situation of this woman to be fixed, it was getting worse. Before I continue, I have a cousin before I went to Kichasa in July uh, he was in Jedi Jedi, a shoe shop okay and I found the shoes which I lacked I was like and I thought this will look nice in so I bought it and I went to Congo and I went to one of my cousins is older than me he said, Ah, yeah, yeah. And he said, My brother, oh, yo, kaka. only these shoes, nothing else. And he took the shoes I gave to him. When I came back to Europe, two weeks later, two semaines après, I heard uh, they, 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 they cast a spell on him, Basu. And it hurt me so much. Few by looking for help same as this woman instead of the situation of the leg to get better it grew ups when they sent me the first picture it was great it wasn't that bad but the second picture they sent me I sent it to Mama Fifi you can, if we put a picture on the screen you will not eat the whole leg has gone and you can see the bond inside by looking for help they tell, they tell they told him there's a mama there who can help you and he, he went to another place they said there's a mama who can help you instead of the situation to get better but the situation grows worse but this woman I believe if someone sick for so long she will have a, a revelation of, uh, uh, of many things and I believe she buy books and she was reading all these books and the situation was still the same and she bought another book and the situation was still the same the Bible said that she spent everything that she had and the situation grew worse then the Bible said one day she heard about a man called Jesus and uh, I believe that before she heard about Jesus by people she was reading the Bible and I believe the Bible was one of her last hope book that she had for her life but that Bible was only the Old Testament. And she started by reading the book of Genesis. Investigating for a situation. And there was not a solution for her. And she went to the book of Numbers. She read. And there was not a solution for her. But then she came to she came across to the book of Daniel chapter 9 verse 3 chapter 9 verse 3 and she read the Bible said that the during of the reign of the king Jairus that, that I Daniel I understood through the reading of the book that the years that we supposed to spend in slavery was 70 years but how come is more than 70 years and we still in bondage 
And if you read the book of Daniel chapter 9 verse 3 so go thank you, live your Daniel The Bible said that I Daniel while I understood that the years that we supposed to spend in slavery has already passed and we still in slavery. The Bible says, I set my Daniel said, I set myself in prayer. In supplication. Praying to God to deliver the people. And we know the result. And the Lord visited Daniel. But this woman passed the book of Daniel. I read the book of Daniel, sorry. And she understood. And she said, This is the best book to read. And I believe if I keep reading this book, I will find a solution, something that is similar to my case. So she continued to read, passing the book of Daniel. And she kept reading the book keep reading the bible and she begin go reading the bible investigating but one thing was disappointing this woman because there was nobody who were forced healed by the issue of blood so she couldn't find a solution to her problem and she cannot even go out to ask for the more because it was forbidden in that time for someone who's bleeding to go out and she didn't have any money anymore she was broke the bible says she spent everything that she had so her last hope was only the bible which was the word of god i've heard preachers say that this woman was the woman of faith because jesus said your faith has healed you but i want to tell you that this woman was a prophetic woman she was a woman of revelations she was reading the Bible even though you call her a woman of faith but the Bible said that faith comes by hearing by hearing the word of God so I believe she was listening to the word of God I believe there were some brother who were going to visit her at house and preaching to her and all this book that she have in her, in her house she have finished every page of reading it and her last hope was this Bible and this Bible did not have a revelation no john no no mark no it did not have false correction nothing the only bible the, the, the only books were there the only the old testament by reading this book her last hope was lying on the book and she continued reading she continued reading and she reads in the book of Malachi which is the last book of the Bible and the woman opened the first page Malachi chapter 1 she finished all the verses and there was no answer to her problem and she opened Malachi chapter 2 she read all the verses and there was no answer to her problem and she read Malachi chapter 3 and there was no answer she was left all Malachi only have 4 chapters and she was left only 1 page of the Bible I want you to take your Bible open it only from Genesis to Malachi chapter 4 now I want you just to hold that verse that chapter that only page for verse 4 and that was the only hope that she had I can believe this woman was sitting down 
And he said, Jehovah God, I, I, I thought I could find help into the Bible. I read all the verses in the Bible. And I did not find anything. Lord, please, in this last verse that I have left, if only you may speak to me, if only you may show me something. So she opened Malachi chapter 4 verse 1. She read and there was no solution. Then she came across Malachi chapter 4 verse 2. Oh my God. Let's read Malachi chapter 2. Malachi chapter 4 verse 2. This was the last page her Bible. This is what I call the revelation. Oh my God. Things that keep falling. Malachi chapter 4. Who have, can read for us? Yes. Mm. 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 Amen. Amen. So she read everything. Then the last page of Malachi. It was her hope. And she came across what the verse the Bible said. But unto you that fear my name. That shall the son of the righteous shall arise with healing on his wing. And you shall go forth. This woman said, Who is this the son of righteousness? Who is this the son of righteousness? And she heard about the man called Jesus. Now, in the old time, they used to wear these clothes, the, this garment. It was like a no bazen. And the very edge of it, if you look even the internet, they used to call the wings mapapu. And this woman heard about Jesus going around healing people, going around doing good. And Jesus was on his way for another person miracle. I believe Jesus is there for somebody else. I believe Jesus has come only for one person here. But this woman said, I don't care. I don't care where you're going to deliver the miracle. But I'm going to make my way in and interrupt for my healing. The woman had a revelation. She said, if only I can touch the hem of his garment, I shall be healed. She left her house. She began to go. While she was going, the people say, look at that woman. She has the issue of blood. They pick up their stone. They begin to follow her. The moment they wanted to throw the stone at her, then she touched and Jesus looked around. He said, who touched me? The Bible said people denied. Now, for you to deny something, you must, that means you have done it. You cannot deny something that you have not done. The people could have said, the people said, no, we did not touch you. But the people denied. And Peter said, Master, can't you see? There are a lot of people here. But how can you say, Who touched me? Why there's a crowd that's touching you? But 
Jesus knew because he felt the power left in him. Only because the woman touched with the revelations. Because the woman knew that this is the wing of the son of the righteous. What I'm looking at is the wing which carry, which carry healing. I don't know if you see it's a crossbow. For me, it's a, it's a wing. Those are the feather of the son of the righteousness which carry healings and Jesus stopped because many people were touching him but they were not touching him without a revelation but this woman came with a revelation from my house he said that for you I know you are walking with him and you are calling him Emmanuel you are saying God is among us God is with us uh, but I came with a different revelation for me he is the son of the righteousness and I know that my healing lie on his robe. Ah, if only I may touch the hem of his garment, my bleeding shall stop. Ah, it doesn't matter if you are walking with Jesus. What matters is what revelation do you have about this Jesus? You see there were a lot of people walking with Jesus. They were happy and comfortable. There were sick people among them. Nobody was getting healed. But there was a blind man who could not see with the physical eyes but with the spiritual eyes. His name was Bartimaeus. For them, they were calling Jesus. And he also called Jesus. And Jesus was keep walking. He called Jesus like the other were calling Jesus. And Jesus did not stop. Then this blind man but have revelation to the spiritual eyes. He said, Jesus, thou son of David, have mercy on me. Everybody were calling Jesus. He did not stop. The moment Jesus heard a revelation, that son of David, he turned around and said, what can I do for you? You see, it doesn't matter what you are calling Jesus. But you need to come up with a revelation of your own. Your situation needs a revelation of your own. Your situation needs a revelation of your own. It doesn't matter if my friend call him my provider. It doesn't matter if your neighbor is calling Jehovah Jireh. But for my condition, I need a name to give Jesus. This woman said, I I don't care what you're calling him. But for me, he is the son of the righteousness. Because the Bible says, for those who fear his name, thou shalt the son of the righteousness. Le soleil de la justice, he shall arise with healings on his feather, on his wings. So I know that Jesus, he is the son of righteousness. And he do carry healing. If only I'm attached if only I may go forth if only I may press through the ground I believe there were people stopping him I don't care who's stopping you for to reach your miracle today but keep pressing on keep pressing on keep moving forward tell your neighbor move forward move forward move forward for your situation move forward don't give up and I believe this woman was running because there were people with stone running after her they wanted to stone her because she was not allowed to be among people but the moment she faced with Jesus they all begin to drop their tongue and I know you came to meet Jesus today your situation is getting an answer those who wanted to laugh at you those wanted to mock at you, they will drop their evil words. They will not say what they were supposed to say. They will change their words. They will change their mind. Because you came to meet with Jesus. He is the son of righteousness. He is here this morning. If you feel his presence, clap for Jesus. If you feel it, I don't know where you are sitting over. I don't know why you're still sitting over. Namatea Bogoko Vandate. Namatea Bogoko Vandate. Your situation can exist been for so long. For this woman was 12 years. I don't know how many years your situation has said. Maybe one week, maybe two months. But I'm going to show you today. Jesus, the Son of Righteousness, is here in this place. He's here in this place. He's here in this place. 
presence. Only if you can touch him by faith. If you can touch him by faith, your situation will change. Shout for Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Sometimes it takes a crafty faith. Sometimes it takes a crazy revelation. Listen to me. Now they send me a picture. But in Linga for uh, my cousin was uh, the boss who I, I could not eat that day. And I sat there and said, God, how can this happen without you revealing to me? But I came to the point and said, No, we're just man. We're just human. This is what show God is God. Things can happen without you. I cried. Then the Holy Spirit came to me. He said, Why are you crying? I said, I'm crying because my cousin he cannot wear the shoes that I gave to him. The Holy Spirit says, Shut up. He said, Did you wear that shoes? I said, Yes, I did. He said, How can your cousin get mbasu when he wears the same shoes that you were wearing? You're not listening to me. You're not listening to me. The Holy Spirit said, Shut up. The same shoes you were wearing. Your cousin also wearing. And Mbasu still get him. He said no. It can never happen. We call your cousin. Tell him before you wear that shoes. I wore it first. Even though he cannot wear with the legs and the, the foot that has basu, but that other foot that still exists. Tell him to put it on. I don't know if you're getting me. I don't know if you're getting me. And I called him. I said, You insulted me. I said, He said, Why? Can't you see I'm suffering? I said, How can you wear my shoes and get basu? I want you to put on the other shoes that I left. I don't know if you're getting me. I don't know if you're getting me. Every single day of your life. Put it on. And I also send the man of God to go and pray for him. The legs that you could have seen the bones. I'm telling you if I say that I'm you, you insulted me. It was a small dot here. It has gone all this way. And this bone, you can see it and the veins, everything. But once you won that shoes, and the man of God pray for you. Two days, two small dot here. The meat Hallelujah. Amen. And he could have not walk, but now he can. He can. He can, he can, he can walk. So the only thing left is the skin to to appear. That's the revelations. Listen, there, there are things that you need revelation. And he could have not walk, but now he can, he can. We read the Bible, but you must come out with a revelation to the scripture that you read. Is the skin to many people has laughed at you. Many people has mocked you. It's because you are loved. Only if you can find the revelation. Only if you can find the revelation in your situation. Your situation will never be the same. Your situation will never be the same. The things that people are mocking you. If only you can cry to the son of the righteousness. And say, Jesus Christ, interfere on my case. If only you can touch him, with faith, the things that people are mocking you. The Bible said, if only the righteous, the son of the righteous, and say, Jesus Christ, and we interfere on my case. If only you can touch him, the Bible said, but those who come to Jesus, to God, they must believe that exists. And he is the reward.
order of people who digitally seek him. People who seek him non stop. People who seek him without any fear. People who put their faith. When the woman came to Jesus, people, Jesus said, Your faith, your faith has healed you. How many people have faith today? How many people who believe for, for miracle in their life? How many people who believe God can do something? If you have faith, I want you to stand up because we're going to pray. I believe with your faith, God will do something. God will do something. Can I have the musician on the stage? How many people believe God can do something? Lift up your hands. I want you to stand up. Say, my father, my father. We're going to pray. Uh, uh, you're I not saying that with energy. Faith. Say, my father, my father. God will do no, something. you're not saying it like you have a revelation. Say, my father, my father. Can I have the music? Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. Give me a revelation. Say, my father, Give me a revelation. A revelation beyond my shame. Say, my father, my father. Give me a revelation. No, you're not saying A revelation beyond my problem. As I clap my hands and pray. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. Give me a revelation. Clap your hands and begin to pray. Clap your hands. You're not clapping your hands. You're not clapping your hands. You're not praying like you want change. Somebody come and pray. Come and pray. Come Come on, pray. Come on, pray. Come on, pray. Say, oh Lord, give me a revelation beyond my shame. Give me a revelation beyond my shame. My situation has tarried. Come on, pray, somebody. Don't wait for the musician. It's about you. You know how long your problem has been. It has been for two months. It has been for a month. It has been for years. It has been for a long time. Come on, pray. Come on, pray. Come on, pray. Father, we pray in the mighty name of Jesus. Jesus. Somebody, somebody you're praying. You know don't stop praying. Don't wait for music to accompany you. It's, it's about you. It's not about, you. It's not about your neighbor. For your situation that people are talking about. That the whole Dublin is talking about. That your in-laws are talking about. Somebody you're praying. It's only about you. It's your shame. Pray to God. Pray to God. Say, God, I want a revelation. God, take me out of this situation. Oh, pray somebody, pray, 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 pray. Pray somebody, pray, 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 pray. It's only about you. Father, we pray in the name of Jesus. Father, we pray to you this morning. This afternoon, we pray for revelation. Oh, Lord, my situation has been like this for a long time. My situation has been like this for a long time. It has gone for years, oh God Almighty. The people are talking about me. Shame has come into my family. Shame has hindered my family, oh God. Only if you can reveal your step to me today. Only if you can touch you with my faith. Oh God, you are able. You are able. You are able to stop the bleeding of my heart. You are able to stop everything I'm suffering. You are able to heal me from my disease. You are able to heal me, oh God. Thou son of David, have mercy upon my life. Kababo Sata. Pray somebody. Pray, 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 pray. pray, pray. Oh, thank you, Lord Jesus. Somebody's clapping their hand of praise. Say, Lord, I need a revelation. In this season, oh, don't pass me by today. Speak to me, oh God. Speak to me, oh God. Heal my disease. Heal my heart, oh God. Heal my crying, oh heart, oh God. Cry before Jesus. Like Bartimaeus cried. He said, Thou son of David, Thou son of David, have mercy on me. I want to see again. I'm blind. I don't have sight. They carry me every morning. They show me the way every morning. They lead me. I'm depending on people. Say, God, from today, I don't want to depend on anybody here. Oh, God, Nazan Elokote, Nazana Valer, Batoking Amiki, Baseking Amiki, Balobio Swanini, Old Zambe, Nazo Sema Revelation, Olo Molamana Sony Oyo, Olo Molamana Psi Oyo, and now they meet his never still a day. Famina Namona Loboko Nayo.
année 2017 et 2019, on est la télé. Oh, les mots sont dans le monde à l'oboko. Banana à l'oboko. Ça, on est en compte en 2020, on est en compte. Oh, mon compte, on est en compte. Le compte 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 est en compte. Sala na bara na ngai Sala na fami na ngai Sala na mobali na ngai Sala na mwasi na ngai Sala na likomba oyo Oh tsambe Bonde la ndeko na ngai Soko bonde li tena na obonde la mwale Soko bonde li tena na obonde la bona yo Batu nyo suwa ya kipa yesu Pura wa problem na bako Mwasi opa ya kipa wa problem na ye Aya kite pot na uko na yabika Aya kite pot na tamuwa sinabika Aya kite pot bana na yabika Aya kite pot koko na yabika Ma ya kipo na problem na yo Yo pena tomwa lelo yepo na problem na yo Leka la kobonde la Loba yesu Mwana na Dawid Yo ke la bisoma wa Ba seki bisomi ki Oh ba demo ba nyoko li bisomi ki Milimo ma bewa nyoko li bisomi ki Melo Loko na zopeta maboko na abonde la Loko na zopeta maboko na zopeta la Na zopo na loboko na oko kako la miso Na zopo na loboko na oko seto spri Na zopo na loboko na oko me mabiso na badimasyo mosusu Na zopo na loboko na ole liboko oko me mabiso na badimasyo mosusu Na zopo na badona yoko seko koko kita na ngomba oyo Na zopo na makabwe zo shanshe Na libota na gana zopo na kimi ano zo kota Onyo so za kima depansi na bobito Na yebi ke lelo Zambe na nga Na simbio na kondima Na simbio na fwa Na simbio na fwa Na bebi simbongo na ba dokter Do bebi simbongo na ba madona Do bebi simbongo na bo koko Do bebi simbongo Be solisho zo zwa mate Be solisho zwa mate Do tika la se na yo yesu Do tika la se na yo yesu Espoir ya suka elibota na biso Espoir ya suka ya bongo na biso Ya moto ena tomo alelo Na inglis jesi kusta la fami Do tombo li mikongo kolo baete Espoir na biso ya suke sayo Wa minga kabalia biso bongo Do nefi na ba kredidio Do nefi na ba providansa Na lebi kontinda ba wesle Me na simbio na kondi malelo Pona ndeko na mazo bela na fwika Na simbio na kondi malelo Pona kimye kota na libota na kai Na simbio na kondi malelo Pona kongo na bobo na kai Polo kona nzambe Pona nyoswe za haki na bobo na kai Pona nyoswe ya batasyon Pona kita na kombata Pona nyoswe ba stress Pona nyoswe za ayo Oh mon côté n'a pas moi Le soleil de la justice Oh mon qui dit sa justice n'a yo N'a pas de mauvais Zon n'a pas la biso N'a pas mari de nuit N'a pas femme de nuit N'a pas lié au cannabiso Oué cannabiso va s'y mettre à l'okolo L'okolo la taba Oué cannabiso va s'y mettre à qui Mou l'okolo la taba Ton lié à cannabiso va s'y mettre Oh Zambé Kita Oh le soleil de la justice Oui mais y'a bi s'y mettre Si elle est assis à la droite du père tu es en train d'intercéder pour nous. On salue notre avocat auprès du Père. On attend moi les lots. Ça la justice n'a pas. Quand elle a ma yespasia. Quand elle a ma mon avocat. Quand elle a mis son pour la licabo. Maman Bondela. Papa Bondela. Donc moi les lots à l'eau pour la tombe n'y a sauté. Dimanche à l'eau les lots à l'eau la dimanche n'y a sauté. Le soleil de la justice. Azan est si koyo. Azan est si koyo. Notre avocat auprès du Père. Azan Azako enti excede, azako enti excede, azako enti excede, azako enti excede. Bo na libota na yo, bo na fami na yo. Yaya bondela, yaya bondela. Ezo boti ni temu neni. Mama bondela, papa bondela. Azawa, ocho eko kumisa. Yesu Kristo de Nazareth. Azawa, azawa bo na boya nola yo. Lobo kona ezo boku sete. Ezo kambola. Ezo kambola Soko dimi loba na dimi Soko dimi loba je resoa Loba je resoa Je resoa ma délivrance Je resoa ma délivrance Je resoa ma guérison Na resevoa qui vient à l'imote à la main 
Lobana yapi Banda ko kubi sae Ko wa sali na bobo na yo Kubi sae, kubi sae, bete la yma bobo Loba je resois Je resois ma délivrance Je resois ma délivrance Je resois ma guérison Ma recevoir qui vient à l'animal de là-bas Lobana yapi Banda ko kubi sae Ko wa sali na bobo na yo Kubi sae, kubi sae, bete la yma bobo Loba je resois Adonai, le Dieu créateur, l'univers dans ta main, Seigneur, éternel de ton nom. Adonai. Que mon tombeau rasane se mon atome à l'élo. Nazo au caotosan se mon atome à l'élo. Bête la tombe, milolo, 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 milolo. Bête la tombe, milolo. Nazo au camaboko na ote. Bête la tombe, milolo. Bête la tombe, milolo. Bête la tombe, milolo. Nazo au caotosan se mon atome à l'élo. Alléluia. Amen. May God bless us all. Hallelujah. Are you truly blessed this morning? Brother David, I believe the message is for me this morning. I have received my part. I don't know what you have received this morning. So we are now at a time of joy where we want to offer to our Amen. Amen. Okay. So let us prepare our tithes and our offerings. And we will follow the order of the ushers and the leaders. I don't know what you have received this morning. I don't know what you have received this morning. I don't know what you have received this morning. I don't know what you have received this morning. I don't know what you have received this morning. So let us prepare our tithes and our offerings, and we will follow the order of the ushers and the leaders. I don't know what you give in our tithes and offerings to God. So let us prepare our tithes and our offerings. Let us pray. 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 Let us pray.
Danny Bass. No, his name is no more Danny Bass. Evangelist. Because he gave an evangelistic message. Oscar Pesci, message evangelist. Yes, he plays, he's still playing the bass. Danny oui, Bass. No, his name Bas is no more Danny Bass. The perspective of Messi. Evangelist today. Evangelist. Il met pas na yele lo. Oscar Pesci. Message. Ah, Pesci message yes. evangelist. Amen. Amen. In a point of time, he will be. So by the revelation, we're still waiting on God. Na gonga oye kukuka anko servi nzambi na revelation tozo zela kakati. If he is a prophet, so kaza prophet. Because some prophets sometimes, prophets sometimes they give messages to evangelists. O prophet msu su uta msu saka message uta kebe evangelist. That's not my problem today. Is a problem nanga elelote. So Gaza. Congratulations. Merci papa. You have passed the test. With the distinction, 95 percent, only five for God. Do you want to see him next time? Good. With the distinction, 95%, only five for God.